Aussie Fitness. Uh, I'm back after like almost three weeks was sickness that uh, uh, COVID-19. They get me, so I don't know how they get me. But uh, the reason I'm trying to tell you guys, you make sure you heard in the news, don't come out of the house. Means they have a between, uh, don't come out, come out the house for two weeks. That between that two weeks, you never know who has it, who it on. That's why you don't want to catch you, uh, from somebody else. They keep go around, go around. Make sure when you go outside, to, if you have to. What happened is, when I go outside, me and my kids, right now, we always wear this uh, face mark. This is the best thing one of my cousins, wonderful person, he did for all of our family members, he sent for each one of us. He makes sure when you go outside, you wear gloves. Gloves is, uh, doesn't matter. I always think in some of our family members, they think, oh, I'm young, they're never gonna catch me or they, this or that, but you never know that disease is out there. You make sure you be careful when you go outside. So, first of all, uh, face mark and at the same time in uh, gloves. And uh, like a guy like me, if I got it, anybody else could get it. Because physically, I know I don't look big, but I'm very strong as I always work it out. So this way, is, if they get me, get anybody. They could knock it down. So, what what we do for uh, for us to get better for that uh, almost uh, that three weeks? So I always put hot water. This is I'm gonna tell you guys so you could do that at home. Be prepared. Be ready in case if that happened to you guys. I always have a uh, hot water at the night times. And I'm it. So this is the 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 wicks. You put them inside. What happened is, see, the, all the smells coming out because that disease that will stay inside here for a week. They're gonna stay inside your nose in that areas. You ride me next. This is the place is uh, cool, they keep yourself uh, cool. So if you wear something warm, and knock them down. It better knock them down, go to your stomach. You don't want them to go to your, uh, your uh, lung. When they go wrong, it's hard for you to breathe. You make sure you do that. What happen, I always do that, uh, uh, that's it. One of my sons, we always, uh, at night times, we we'll put that in, we we'll put the, uh, move up a little bit. Okay. Good. <laughs> so we put the wax inside. You make sure the reason we put a towel to do the breathe go to his mouth and his nose. You don't have to go outside because they want to make sure you breathe it. Open your mouth big time. You make sure go all around. Every night we, you do this at least twice a day, daytime and night times. Breathe it. So usually we do that more time, but right now we don't have a time, so you good? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's one of the, the medicine we use in home. The second medicine we owe at home, be prepared for that before that. Uh, make sure your body got to be stronger when the disease attack you, you have something to fight back. What, what we do with this, this is, uh, we're making a lemon, ginger, and a honey. I'll put them in a mixer, a mixer, then they come out just like this. It tastes good. I know that the uh, ginger doesn't taste good, but what happened is with that disease, we, uh, 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 coronavirus, this is the one of the best medicine, it uh, fight back. 
you make your body stronger. So what happened is lemon, uh, ginger, and honey. You mix it up every day, one spoon a day, you're gonna eat it, so twice a day. This is one of them. So beside that, and that's why you guys have any questions anytime, you could send me messages, I will respond you guys back. But I wish you guys the best and make sure don't go outside, you don't really have to. If you go outside, you make sure you have a mask and stay away from people around you. So you never know who has it, who don't have it. So I want to wish you guys the best and good luck. If you guys have any questions, you always could reach me. Thank you.